A Kohata man is fighting for his life after a go-kart accident on Memorial Day weekend. Xavier Harris says his family is pleading for blood donors. Right now I'm on Beaverdale Road and this is the road where Andrew Holt was driving his go-kart when he crashed it into another car. Now today I spoke with his family and they tell me he always did handiwork on ATVs and go-karts, which is what they believe caused him to wreck. He loved everybody. He would give you anything he had. And now 27 year old Andrew Holt is the one in need. His family says he's been in the hospital since Memorial Day fighting for his life. They had to cut his legs open on two sides to allow it to swell on the left side and they had to cut him from the chest down because the go-kart actually pushed his organs forward and out of place so that caused a lot of swelling. So they had to open up his chest cavity. Undergoing several surgeries while in the hospital, Holt's grandmother, Donna Eubank, says he constantly needs blood. Right now he's gone through over 300 units of blood. The day of the accident, officials with Blood Assurance says that one accident nearly cleared out their blood bank, so they turned to the public and made calls. And I typically turn down because I need to and psych myself up. Laura Allen says when she donates blood, she gets dizzy and sick, so she tends not to go regularly. But she says she was one of the people that got the call to help save Holt's life. I may be in that situation or I may have a family member in that situation where one day I'm relying on other people and I want to do my part now. And that's something Holt's family is grateful for. Had it not been for the people that have donated blood, I know we would have lost Andrew. You know, none of us know him, and I think this is kind of a, a good showing of, you know, people are good, <laughs> so we care about each other, and we were all willing to just kind of drop everything and go and help him, and we just hope for the best and hope he can make it through this.